Welcome students. This is second part of important MCQs for PAT 2 for basic science subject chemistry. Now question number 51 is what atmospheric corrosion called? It is also called as dry corrosion or direct chemical corrosion. Corrosion of metal means decay or destruction of metal. Then electron potential it is the tendency of metal to lose and gain of electron when Combined tendency it is known as electrode potential when there is only loss of electron then it is known as oxidation potential if there is only gain of electron then it is known as reduction potential. Then food stuff containers should not be galvanized because zinc present in galvanized coating it poison the food content therefore it should not be galvanized while food stuff containers should be tin. Which process is used for uh, to coating superior metal on base metal? Electroplating or electro coating. This process is used for coating superior metal on base metal. Compounds formed by ionic bonds are good conductor of electro electricity. Ionic bond or electrovalent bond. Then compounds formed by covalent bonds. These are poor conductor of electricity. Which metal is coated on iron during galvanizing? Zinc is coated on iron during galvanizing. The process of decomposition of electrolyte in presence of electric current, it is known as electrolysis. Decomposition that means breaking up of the substance. The mathematical relation of Faraday's first law is W is equal to ZCT. W that means weight, Z is constant, C that is current in ampere and T is time in seconds. The method of electrolysis which is used to improve corrosion resistance of any metal it is known as electroplating. Name the mechanism of corrosion. In given situation a metallic structure with two dissimilar metals built in river polluted with acidic waste from industry. Acidic waste therefore it is the hydrogen evolution type of mechanism and it is the immerse corrosion because two dissimilar metals are present. Rusting of iron in neutral aqueous solution in presence of atmospheric oxygen. When a drop of water is resting on iron surface, it is the oxygen absorption mechanism. It is also second type of immerse corrosion. Then underground part of buried electric pole undergoes corrosion due to differential air concentration. That means less excess of oxygen. Which ions moves to anode during electrolysis? Anions moves to anode while cations moves to cathode during electrolysis. The secondary cells are also called as non-rechargeable cells. Sorry, secondary cells are rechargeable cells. Then right type of potential developed at copper electrode when deep in copper sulfate solution. It is the reduction potential. The process due to which Water splits up into hydrogen and hydroxyl ion. It is known as dissociation. Then cathodic corrosion inhibitors use are amines and urea. While anodic corrosion inhibitors are phosphates and chromates. In Daniel cell, the reactions are oxidation occurs at zinc electrode while reduction occurs at copper electrode. Electrovalent compounds are soluble in water as they have high ionization power. That means formation of ions is more in electrovalent compound. The substance which allow electricity to pass through them in liquid state it is known as electrolyte. In the figure given below the part A represent molten tin at temperature 232 degrees Celsius. This is the melting point of tin, 232 degrees Celsius. And this process is tinning process. Name the type of corrosion. When steel pipe is connected to copper plumbing, it is galvanic cell type of corrosion. That means two different metals are in contact with each other. One metal get corroded, it is galvanic cell formation. The chemical reaction in secondary cell is reversible. During electro refining of blister copper, 10% H2SO4 added to electrolyte to increase the dissociation. The product obtained at cathode during electrolysis of aqueous copper sulfate solution using copper electrode, the product is pure copper. 
नेम द टाइप ऑफ करोजन वेन स्टील पाइप इज कनेक्टेड टू कॉपर प्लम्बिंग इट इज गैलवनिक सेल टाइप ऑफ करोजन बिकॉज स्टील एंड कॉपर दीज आर डिफरेंट मेटल्स इन कॉन्टैक्ट विथ ईच अदर इलेक्ट्रोकेमिकल इक्विवेलेंट ऑफ मेटल इज वाई ग्रैम पर कुलूम द इक्विवेलेंट वेट ऑफ मेटल इज डैश वाई इन टू Then next is identify the substances which form physical barrier between metal and corroding medium and reduce the corrosion. These are the substances which form physical barrier: amines and urea, phosphates and chromates, dichlorohexaammonium nitrate. These are the substances form physical barrier between metal and corroding medium. Identify the substances which form physical barrier in vapor phase. It is dichlorohexaamyl ammonium nitrate. Which film is more corrosive? Volatile film is more corrosive, which is formed in molybdenum. Which film is more protective? Unstable film, which is formed in gold, silver, and platinum. Then next is porous film formation take place in case of alkali metals and alkaline earth metals like calcium, sodium, potassium, lithium. Then non-porous film formation take place in case of aluminium, chromium, copper. Then 92 example of unstable film again gold, silver, platinum, volatile film, molybdenum. Corrosion due to atmospheric gases is known as atmospheric or dry corrosion. The corrosion which is brought about through ionic reaction in presence of conducting medium, it is known as immersed corrosion, which is also known as wet corrosion and also known as electrochemical corrosion. Two metals in contact. that type of corrosion is known as galvanic cell formation one metal will be corroded and another metal will be protected when single metal is surrounded by conducting medium then it is known as concentration cell formation type of corrosion it is also electrochemical corrosion in hydrogen evolution type of corrosion cathode is small and anode is large in this type of mechanism copper is act as cathode which is small while steel tank the whole steel tank which is large it is act as anode in oxygen absorption mechanism cathodic area is large and anode is small the crack which is formed on the surface of oxide film it is act as anode and metal get corroded here while the whole oxide film act as cathode in stainless steel 2% molybdenum is added to enhance resistivity towards pitting corrosion then water line corrosion is differential aeration type of corrosion that means different axis of oxygen therefore water line corrosion take place in water line corrosion corrosion starts just below the water line the corrosion which occurs between metal and metal also metal and non metal surface gap it is known as crevice corrosion acids are more corrosive than neutral or alkaline solutions if two uh, three solutions are there acid base and neutral then more corrosion will take place in acid the rate of atmospheric corrosion increases with impurities humidity and temperature with increasing all rate of corrosion increases tinning that is coating of less electropositive metal on base metal that is iron while galvanizing is coating of more electropositive metal that is zinc on iron metal melting point of zinc is 419 while tin is 232 in annealing temperature is 650 which is used in galvanizing process Which of the following metals are used as sacrificial anode? Magnesium, zinc, aluminium. These are used as sacrificial anode. For underground pipes and cables, sacrificial anodic method is used. Electrolytic conductor example: acid, base, and salt. Metallic conductor: copper. Then uh, silver, aluminium. Electrochemical cell: chemical energy converted into electrical energy. while in electrolytic cell electrical energy converted into chemical energy ionization that is breaking up of substance into charged atoms dissociation breaking up of substance into electrovalent compound emf of cell is 1.